Hi friends, how are you? This is the Cold Donut speaking, and welcome back to some more Tech It Classic. And last time we got this whole little base set up, and we have our machines here. Today, I want to actually go for the extractor, for one thing. I want to go for this machine, and for this we're going to need four tree taps, a machine block, and a circuit. So what we need right now in order to accomplish that is, I believe we need a little more wire. Uh, yeah, I think we're going to need a little more wire. We're going to need some wood, and then we're going to need some iron. So the first thing we're going to do is get some wood right now, and then we're going to check on our rubber trees and see if we can get a little more from them. Looks like we still have a few saplings that haven't grown. Maybe we'll have to move them. But the reason why I do want the extractor is because these, every single one of these could be three. That could be 30 rubber right there. So that is an important thing to get that accomplished. But unfortunately, we just broke that, uh, that tree tap. So we'll have to get, so we'll have to continue harvesting rubber later. But another reason why I want wood, and you can see there I got an achievement. I don't think it keeps, uh, it saves those when I, uh, leave the game. But another reason I want wood is to get the automatic crafting table that we looked into last episode because we didn't have quite enough wood to get that done last time. So there we go. Oop. Once again, I'm hitting control. Sorry about that, guys. I keep forgetting. This is not 1.7. You cannot use control to sprint. Control is optifine zoom so that you can do things like zoom in on that and see what's going on. Which is actually very helpful for you, uh, for me to show you guys things. Okay, so some sticks here and some gears. We were very close, actually, to getting everything we needed. We just didn't quite have enough. So we're gonna do that. Sticks. One more gear. And then is it... How is it? I think it's a crafting table in the center, isn't it? I think it is. Uh, let's see, is it just like this? Yes, it is. Okay. That is awesome. Really, really awesome. So we're actually going to put that one down here, where we're working with our machines. And as you can see, we can put our wood in here, and it doesn't leave the crafting table. That's one of the things that's really awesome about this. And you can also have it automatically make things for you, but uh, we're not going to worry about that right now. Uh, I'm not entirely sure exactly how all of this works, because it's been a while since I used automatic crafting tables. But, anyways, we do need to go for the extractor. Uh, I'm losing my focus. So, that means, first of all, let's get some more tree taps. We need a few more. So, what is it? It's just... Uh, no, man, have I already forgot the recipe? It's that. No. It's that. Nope. Oh, come on. I really forgot this already. Hang on. I think I can do this, guys. Don't worry. I can get it. Fine. I'll look at the recipe. I totally forgot how to make the tree tap. I cannot believe I'm that silly. Recipe. Oh, that's how it looks. I wasn't that far off. There we go. Let's make three more of them. Oh, I can't even... Can I not even make that many? Yes, I can. And we're going to put them in the automatic crafting table so that it saves our recipe. No, like that. Now, we need to go mining to get some more iron because we are running low. Let's see, I do have enough copper to make the rest of the wires, so let's get some uh, redstone. If, why did I just... I don't even know why I just said redstone. Let's get some... Oh, I don't even have coal. Wow. I really need to go mining then, guys, apparently. So let's get on that then. Let's uh, head back down into the mines and get ourselves uh, some materials because we really are uh, lower than I thought we were. So here's some marble. Eventually I'm going to want some of this. But look right here. Iron. Here we go. So easily obtained. Why would I have not have gotten this before? Well, I just hit control again. This right here, this is what uranium looks like uh, as an ore. 
So as I said before, that's something we're going to need. Uh, oh, I can actually make some torches if I grab this coal so you guys can see a little bit better. Because I know that it can be a little bit difficult to see uh, on YouTube. Just because the brightness is a little bit different. So, here we go. Twelve torches. And now you guys can observe along with me. Alright, let's see. Some copper here. I don't really need this right now. Ores. Yes. Okay. I'm cool with this. Let's get all of it. All that iron. Here we go. Alright, I, I needed the coal. I should actually be mining that then. And obtaining it. Here we go. So some coal as well. Let's grab some of it so we can smelt. Eventually, we're going to be making an electric furnace, which will smelt things for us. Uh, which will be very helpful so that we don't need to use all our coal on that. And I might as well just take this copper since it's here. And there we are. So, we have 20 iron, which will be increased quite a bit by our macerator. I was totally planning on smelting that until I just said that. Uh, and same with all the, uh, the copper that we obtained. And we haven't gotten that much copper yet, so I should really try to get a little bit more. So we can... Oh, okay, keep doing that, guys. I'm so sorry. I keep accidentally uh, pressing control. Even though I know that I shouldn't. I've been playing this for long enough now. Fourth episode here. Uh, I should really not be doing that anymore. Okay, it's a little dark here. Let's get a torch in. Alright. So. We're going to pick this up. 31. That's 62. So we're going to take that and roll with it. And, uh, yeah. There we go. Now we're actually at 36, so that is plenty. I'm gonna grab a little bit of marble in case I want this later on, uh, for building and expanding our house. So just to have a, few, uh, a little bit, that's nice. Hey, you, you, go away. Stop it. And I think I'll get one more just so that I have 16, since it takes four to craft each marble brick. And then, let's get on out of here. Whew. So, pillar up time. And, there we go, as I hit control again by accident. Now we have to get back to base and sleep before all the monsters come out. Because I don't like monsters very much. Ah, uh, and there's our base, and it's... Perfect roofless form. Alright, let's get in the bed. Okay. Sleep. Ah, uh, there we go. Okay. So, we're all good. We also need coal, of course, to run the generator. I forgot about that. Uh, so, let's get some of this macerating. So, let's get the generator fueled up. And while that's happening, we're actually going to smelt this sticky resin. So I'm going to need to take a piece of coal. Just one. I only need one. And we're going to head out here and get that done. Because I don't actually need to smelt all of this uh, sticky resin. So, hmm. Alright. So, to review, we need an electronic circuit and a machine block to add to our extractor recipe. So let's see. Oh, the machines are humming. It's so fun. Alright, I am going to have to smelt this stuff. So I'm hoping that I don't uh, need to use too much more. Hopefully I don't have to get too much more rubber. Uh, okay, there's five more coal there. Let's take you down to two and see how far that gets us. That is six iron dust. I believe I need nine iron ingots, so. Oh, I have to smell everything twice. Oh, that's annoying. Because it's refined iron that I really need, so this is a problem. I am not too happy about that situation. But I am happy about the fact that we've got some ores here. I actually did have some iron dust, so I don't need to smell any more. 
Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't make any more. I actually had four iron dust in the chest, so I should have used that earlier. I could have saved on a bit of materials. I have eight rubber here. This should be enough to make the, uh, the copper cables I need. So if I get two here and I craft these, I get... Oh, that's not how it works? Oh, it's just one-to-one. -one. I totally forgot about that. It's one-to-one. -one. That's really useful. I thought it was going to be two because uh, you put one above each, but that's actually wrong. I got that entirely wrong because you make six copper cables and you have six uh, rubber. So I got that completely, entirely wrong. I was totally fail there for a second. And we're actually going to use this crafting table up here so we don't lose our recipe. So, oh yes, I need a smelt still though. So let's get that done. Uh, I only need nine right now, so let's try to conserve fuel and get that done. So what I need to do, right, right, uh, electronic circuit. I'm getting very distracted right now. I should honestly have a second furnace, but I don't, so we're going to have to get this going. So the electronic circuit is, uh, I believe it's uh, co insulated copper cables on the top and bottom rows, and then uh, redstone on the sides, and then refined iron in the middle. And then the machine block we've seen before, it's just uh, refined iron around the sides. So... We should be able to get all of this stuff cooked up, and we should ju be just fine. If we have to, of course, we can use a wooden plank. I'm perfectly fine with that, but... Let's see, come on. Here we go, we're in pretty good shape. We're gonna get most of this smelted. I'm hoping that I can be efficient and not lose any fuel on re uh, putting this iron into the furnace again, after the iron dust is done. We're actually going to store our leftover iron dust in here for now. Because I am not grabbing enough coal. Why do I do this? I leave myself without coal. It's so silly that I do that. And yet I do. Alright, come on, furnace. Smelt this iron dust. Get it? Put it back in. There we go. That was pretty efficient. So... What I need to do, honestly, is just get so much coal, I don't even know what to do with it. Because I'm always running out. Either that, because I still need it for my generator, even. So, what am I doing? Like, it's not even like uh, I can, the electric furnace will be able to do it without coal. I mean, it'll be more efficient than coal, and it'll certainly be quicker, at least. I don't know how much more efficient it is, but... Honestly... Uh, the thing about it is, I'm gonna need coal for the generator, or for the furnace. Either way, it's gonna take some, uh, a lot of stuff. I have to be more effective with this. <sighs> I really am, uh, I'm being silly here. I should have collected more coal, but now I have to sit here to make sure that all of this cooks. Because I think I'm gonna be one item short, which means I have to get this, uh, wooden plank in here. Right as it empties out of fuel. Oh wait, what am I doing? I am so idiotic today, guys. I am very sorry about that. I just realized that there was a piece of coal in there. Like, what am I doing? I thought, oh, I'm gonna have to put another plank in. I am really off my game today, guys. I'm sorry. I'm kind of derping right now. But we're gonna get this last ironing it's melted, and then we're just gonna put some iron dust in here so we don't waste too much uh, fuel. So, we have eight iron here. I'm actually going to craft that quickly. Get this done. Oh, right. I don't have dragging click uh, to craft either. Because this is not 1.7 or 1.6. But anyways, we do have an extractor. And here we go. Can place it down. Stick our sticky resin in it. We have a little bit of generator power right now. Let's see if we can get some extracting done without losing it all. That may not be possible, but hopefully we can get one done and see the fruits of our labors today. Uh, yet we have no coal because I'm silly. Did we actually get one? Yes, we did. We got three rubber. And it might actually finish the second round. But see, this is really great. Uh, everything's coming along very nicely. 
and soon we can start expanding getting a better storage system set up rather than two single chests at the doorway oh it is gonna finish there we go it may even get all three done with just the charge that was left in the generator that's really awesome so possible next steps for us are electric furnaces uh, the electric furnace could be something uh, if we look here it's an iron furnace uh, with redstone on the sides and an electronics circuit. And an iron furnace can either be just iron ingots or five iron ingots and a furnace, which I think is the better option for us. And the iron furnace runs on coal, but it's actually a little more efficient. So that's something that I'd like to get pretty soon as well. Oh, and we did get all that rubber, so that's good. Uh, this finished up, so that's three more iron ingots. Anyways... The last thing we're going to do this episode is get some more coal. Because I am so silly that I have failed to get coal every single time I've gone mining. I have not gotten nearly as much as I need. So this time, coal, coal, coal. Coal. I'm just going to keep saying coal right now. <sighs> Skellies. No, there's coal there. So you have to go. And Creeper, no, you're not blowing up that coal. No, you're not even going anywhere near that coal. That is my coal. I need this stuff. This is like the most important material I have. Like, honestly, I had more diamonds than I had coal uh, when I went to start this last mining session here. This is absolutely ridiculous that I don't have more. Hug. Oh, copper. I'll take a little bit of it. Uh, actually, why don't I just get it all? Why do I never take all the ore that I see? I don't know. Maybe it's because I'm thinking, oh, well, I need to take inventory space uh, into consideration. Maybe it's I'm thinking, oh, well, I want to conserve time. I can always get it later. Maybe it's, oh, my pick's going to break. Speaking of which, ha, huh, I have a solution to that problem. I have three iron ingots. Yes, there we go. Now, we can keep mining and getting more coal. And some copper. Because we're honestly going to need that. But I am really happy. We've gotten our three starter machines in the, uh, the generator, the macerator, and the extractor. So like I said, possible next steps do include the uh, electric furnace. We can also get some solar panels going to provide new forms of energy that are more efficient. Uh, you can also get water wheels and windmills and all those sorts of cool things. Just going to stop there. Ooh, rubies. Those are like uh, similar to sapphires. You can make some pretty cool tools out of these. And there's a lot of it, so we can get some pretty nice stuff. Oh, and there's sapphires. So we're in really good shape here. And there's more coal. Jackpot. That's, like, more important than these materials right now. Because those, while they're useful for tools, are not going to make or break our success in the game right now. But without a generator, we are not going anywhere in Tech It. So, this is definitely important to grab all of this coal so I never have to do this again. Well, of course I'll have to do it again. I mean, eventually, you run out of resources. But, I mean, look at that. 34 coal. I'm pretty proud of just that this episode. And there's more here. You notice I just skipped over that copper. You want to know why? Because there was coal. And coal is obviously more important than copper. No, uh, it's not. <laughs> but right now, we have more copper uh, than we do coal. So, And coal I'm also unable to macerate right now. So I don't even know if it's possible to macerate. Like if you just... Uh, you leave it uh, in ore form, like with Silk Touch. I don't even know if that's possible. I don't know if it lets you do that. Oh, uranium. Uranium is very useful in equivalent exchange. You can see that EMC value. That is, uh, like, the measurement for how much you can get uh, from one uranium and to produce other items using equivalent exchange. So you can get, uh, say, a ton of coal from one piece of uranium. Uh-uh. Now that would be a lot of coal. You could also get diamonds using uranium and those sorts of things. 
But that's the stuff we're going to have to get into later, because right now our main focus is getting some industrial craft machines going, so we can just uh, get a foothold in this adventure here. And also, I need to head back to base, because we're, uh, we've spent quite a bit of time here today doing this. It's been quite fun. We made a decent bit of progress here. We found some coal. Probably not even enough. Just gonna grab some copper here on the way. But, and I will grab all of it, because I'm gonna be smart this time, because I don't want to have to do this too many times in the future. I don't want every episode to be mining and mining and mining. But, uh, it has been quite fun for me, guys. I hope you guys are enjoying this series, too. I just fell into a hole. That's very nice. And I'm having trouble getting to my slot with cobble. Because I'm silly like that. Oh, here's where I need to jump up. And so, as I mine up this copper, uh, once again, please, please leave some feedback for the series what you're thinking of, it's suggestions for next uh, machines to go after, and new uh, new ideas for bases and things I can produce. This is an emerald, I think I'm gonna grab that. And uh, I really need to head back up, cause uh, once again, uh, first of all, it's gonna be nighttime, and I'd like to sleep through that. Second of all, we spent, as I said before, a lot of time uh, doing this today. And I'd like to wrap things up and look at our machines one more time in all their glory. Put some coal in the generator. And then deal with the rest of our sticky resin, considering that we still have some, I think, back at base. Maybe we don't. I think we actually smelted all of it. And, but, eventually, we can get more. And yes, it's nighttime, as I suspected. So that's unfortunate. But, that's alright, I suppose. Anyways, guys, I hope you have enjoyed. Please remember to like and subscribe if you did. This has been the Cold Donut speaking. Goodbye, friends, and I will see you all next time with some more Tech It Classic.